everyone, welcome back to another episode of WebTech Tutorial. I'm back with another tutorial video on how to log into your ADP pay statement using your desktop. Watch the video till the end to learn how and subscribe to our channel by hitting the subscribe button. Also press the notification bell icon so that YouTube will notify you whenever we post a new video. If you'd like to check your pay statement for ADP, here's how to do it. Open up a web browser. In the address bar at the top, type in ADP pay statement login and press enter. From the numerous of search results displayed on the next page, you can click on this My ADP Login link, which will take you to myadp.adburnhr.com, which will take you to this website right here. Once you click on that, a new tab will open up. Here, simply go ahead and type in your credentials. In the user ID text box, type in your user ID. Make sure to type in a valid one and head over to the password field. In the password area, type in your password correct. Double check by clicking on this little eye icon in the right corner so that you can reveal your password. If you want the system to remember you use your ID so that next time you try to log into your account, you won't have to type it in again and again, you can check this remember use your ID box. But if you're using a public device or a shared mobile device, leave it unchecked before logging in. If you don't remember your use your ID, you can click on Forgot ID link beneath the sign in button and follow the instructions to look for it. Similarly, if you happen to forget your password, click on the Forgot password link and follow the instructions to reset to a new password that will be easier for you to remember next time. After typing in all of your information is correct and you're ready to log in, click on the sign in button and there you'll be able to log into your ADP pay statement account right away. I hope the tutorial was helpful to you. If it was, go ahead and give us a thumbs up, comment down below in the comment box if you have a question or a feedback for us. I'll soon be back with more tutorial videos like this. Thank you for watching.